I I am so so happy and I think a lot of people are and I'm Divine Camel the lead artist on the Black Lives Mural project today I'm proud of the city of Jackson today everybody's been supportive and all the encouragement and the help is greatly appreciated. We're coming together, not just as one people, but of many people to stand up for a cause that, that justly needs attention. Right now we're out here at Juneteenth, um, just celebrating with everyone. Happy Juneteenth to all my beautiful black people. Small business owner, as you can see, I'm African American and I'm proud. Happy to be down here for Black Lives Matter. I think it's a wonderful thing to be able to have all of these people come together to bring awareness and support to the cause of Black Lives Matter. We appreciate all of the support and all the love that everyone has shown us in the community here. And we definitely love this event and this opportunity, Juneteenth, to highlight the freedom and independence of us as a race and as a people. And we encourage people to continue to educate themselves and continue to show the love and support so that we continue to make events like this bigger and bigger. We've got a lot of people out here, diversity among gender, age, race, all of it. And that speaks volumes to the city that we live in and the community that we strive to push forward. It's incredible. It's important that towns like ours that may not necessarily be the biggest town still have a presence that says like, we don't stand for that. We don't accept racism here. They say black lives matter, but it's black lives shatter from the violence that's going on like no lives matter. So I'll make it a Having this painted, you know, and having the city support means everything. And especially, you know, the sheriff, Sheriff Rand, who is racist, has to see this every day when he comes into work. So for people of the community, we want it to be a symbol of love and a message and the message for Sheriff Rand is, you know, this is what your community cares about. We care about black people here and, you know, hopefully it'll cause him to have a little bit of self-reflection and a change of heart. We got our own life, own fam, own biz. If you want to get real We were given an opportunity today to send a message that is detrimental to the health of myself, to the health of these children, and to the citizens of this community, you know, a message that could actually save lives down the line. Somebody pulls into the sheriff's office and they see this before their day of work and they run into a situation and then think differently about it. And they treat that person as if they matter. It's huge. And the city backing us up on this whole thing, this is not an idea that was months in the planning. This is a week and a half of getting through city council, getting through the arts commission. The engineering department worked tirelessly to help us with a grid layout that resulted in us being almost done with our mural at three o'clock. It's incredible. I am a black transgender woman and I have faced enough discrimination in my life and enough hardships, you know. I've had a struggle to become the person I am, the artist I am, and have the career I have. So to be here today with a voice, with a platform, and with this whole community, it's an indescribable feeling. Hi, I'm Victoria. Um, my business is called Torsha Tasty Treats. I have delicious dessert jars for sale, dirt cake jars, um, strawberry, kiwi, pineapple with cake and cheesecake in it. And this is a strawberry banana pudding one and a regular banana pudding one. And I'm coming out with more flavors. So come try them, they're so good. I've tried them all. <laughs> Hello everybody, my name is Justin. I'm one half of J&J &J Hand Pork Candles. J&J &J is a company that me and my wife started from home. We're offering 100% soy candles. Everything is hand poured by hand. We don't add any chemicals or any harmful ingredients that's gonna cause cancer or hurt the ozone. Come check us out. We're on Facebook, J&J &J Hand Poured Candles. We're also on Instagram and Twitter as well. We'd love the support. Hi, this is uh, Lionel with Inner City Customs. We do dye sublimation, custom-made cups. 
custom made shirts. Also, we do dog tags. We're local, Jackson, Michigan. We got help from my friends today, just trying to get the business going. Hi, my name is Aisha. I am the owner of Nevaeh's Heaven Boutique. Um, we specialize in mommy and me items and little girls accessories. We have a location, 2301 East Michigan Ave. It's in Suite um, 100E. It's in the Commercial Exchange Building on the east side. Um, I want you guys to come in and shop with us. We're open from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. Wednesday through Saturday. I thank every person who is out here with us today. I thank you from the bottom of my heart because this is not only important to me, but this is important to a community that has been wounded for generations. It's huge. So I thank everybody. My kids' hands and show them what they can be. Never be street, learn a lesson. It's a lot of people that's going to wonder if heaven still got a ghetto. I never settle. That ain't me. I work.